Okay. Oh, mama. Oh, no, that, yeah. no it, get, it get deep. Because I, <laughs> I feel the same way about Coochie, for real. All right, yeah. You feel so the same way about what? Coochie. Coochie. Like, you can't mm -hmm. even really ask a nigga for nothing no more because they so used to, like, bitches just giving it up for nothing. One nigga was like, I took a bitch at McDonald's. I'm like, hold on, I like no, the 10 piece, but I'm not. Niggas scared to ask for Coochie now because we think y'all going to ask for something. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> if you if you're one of the two, cause all these bitches are asking for and something now. And that's the thing, though. Yeah. Coochie that is ain't true. coochie ain't I think no you ain't way supposed to ask for coochie. I got, I got a controversial uh, coochie used opinion to be so on free. that though. Coochie is not as free as it used to be. Mm, that's not tough. on the blade. It coochie always is not a, on the blade. Here's the thing: because mm -hmm. of, we can't look at it because of who we are. Mm -hmm. We got to look at it as the fact. Take oh. away that, nigga. We'll be paying for coochie, bro. Coochie still gon' coochie costs money, bro. What do you consider paying co for coochie though? Anything. Anytime I gotta swipe that motherfucker card. No, See, that's chimmy. That's chimmy. Like that. That's chimmy. Come out of pocket for gift. Anytime that's I gotta. Tricky. Anytime I'm swiping that card at that point. Because, nigga, bro, niggas, everything we do in our life is for bitches, bro. Mm -hmm. We got to be honest, bro. Mm -hmm. We drive nice cars because mm -hmm. that's what bitches like. Mm -hmm. We make sure our houses are nice because that's what bitches like. Mm -hmm. We wear certain clothes because that's what bitches oh, like. The type of cologne that we wear, yeah. we want to make sure that bitches like oh, it. Mama. When you spending that money because you're investing in the, in, in for you to acquire mm -hmm. more bitches, bro, you, that's where your money is going to. Whether you want it, you got to pinpoint the mm -hmm. shit. So you pick a chick up, y'all go on a date. Mm -hmm. Nigga, you just said this last night on stage, and you mm -hmm. meant this because mm -hmm. you was freestyling when you said it. You know, it. as comedians, you, said, you know it. Nigga, other comedians, nigga, you shit. said after one hundred fifty dollars, it's like, all right, bitch, hold on. What are we doing? I did say you that. You said that. That was a good joke. I it was. Freestyle. You need to write that down. Yeah, you need to write that down. G, at one hundred fifty dollars, you gotta write that down. Yeah, I'm gonna remember it. Nigga, yeah. start yeah. recording because you freestyle so much, bro. You yeah. need to record yourself every time you go on stage, bro. Oh, my mama. You be saying shit, bro. And I, nigga, I'm sitting back there like, nah, that's some real shit. <laughs> and a hundred, and you like, nigga, the, and once we get to hundred fifty dollars, bro, you said something else. You was like, uh, you was like, uh, you was like, um, the bitch uh came over and she went to grab the Casamigo bottle. You like, no, <laughs> no, no, bitch, this this fucking liquor right here, bitch. You need to go get them two bottles of water over there <laughs> if you ain't fucking. Bro, that's real shit. Yeah, that is true. So then that is a good point. That's yeah. still. You, you get pussy, certain bro. bottles, yeah. But paying for pussy, I feel like paying for pussy is a transaction. It, it, like that's trans. Like, like leave it on a dresser type. Yeah, exactly. like I ain't never pay for no and, vagina. Right. That's paying for prostitution. Right. When it's ex exchanged like that. Boom. But like if 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 you wanted to sleep with this nice young lady here and you mm -hmm. knew she wanted that Louis Vuitton bag, mm -hmm. but these and you went and got it. That's <laughs> that's you went and got it to that's get that tricking. pussy. No, you paying for I pussy, feel, bro. Tricking, you shouldn't even have to hunt for the bag for real. Like I yeah. feel like real tricking is like it's a trick. Technically, you get what I'm saying. You shouldn't even. Tricks don't really daddy. get no pussy. That's right. Tricks don't. That tricks is niggas so? who's tricks is nigga who's spending money. He's and spending money because they he just like want you. Your, he enjoy your company. They he like, like your, your company. Time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Now, if That's you gotta a trick. have sex with a bad, I call you a prostitute. Yeah. And now you can't be mad at the ladies because I understand if you don't want to fuck this man for nothing, I understand. I ain't mad at it. But at the end of the day, if you fucking for that bag, you gets down, baby. So what about if a girl get flew out? Like, is that is that selling vagina? No, no, okay. Y'all gotta talk about that before you go out there. It's a case by case basis. If you fly, here's my thing. Boom. This is my thing. If you fly a chick out, and I had a, I had a viral video about this. Uh -huh. If you fly a chick out, I do not feel like she's obligated to give you no pussy. Boom. But now here's mm. the thing. Real niggas, mm -hmm. real niggas is gonna establish that before the plane ticket and is that even that paid That needs to be for. talked about. So when you come out here, what we finna do? What like, we about to do? Cause you don't want yeah. her to come out there and it's giving. You know, because if you ain't fucking, advantage. you ain't staying at my house. You can't stay at my house. You ain't fucking. You're not staying at my house. That's a. Mm -hmm. B. You know what I'm saying? We we're gonna have a time. If we're gonna have a time, you know, it's gonna be a a, a collaborative thing. Like, <laughs> bitch, you gonna take me out, and I'm gonna take you out. Like, right? you know what I'm saying? I fuck with shit. So, right. but if you flying a chick out, uh -huh. if you flying a chick out, bro, anytime I ever then booked a plane ticket, I done made it. I done made it clear. Like, mm -hmm. she done sent me a couple videos up playing with that pussy. Like, that's respectful. It's something. Right. It's something. I needed something to let me know. <laughs> she's before going. Before I that click she's this going. button. Before I go Delta on spirit.com. Uh, 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 <laughs> you need some insurance on that shit. <laughs> I'm making sure. Like, no, nah, man. You coming up off that motherfucker. I, I tell a bitch, like, hey, as soon as you get in the car, mm -hmm. I want some head. Like, I need some head. So you, and I don't be serious, but you got to see what they going to say. Mmm. That's why I'd rather a nigga not even pay for nothing because then a nigga expecting something. So just come with your own shit. Do what you gotta do. So if you gotta but go, but some it's, niggas that it's some niggas that will pay. Like listen, I didn't pay with and had zero expectations 
against mm-hmm. some pussy. Zero expectations. Like, if I got it, I got it. If I didn't, I just wanted to buy with Women you. love right. niggas like you. Yeah. Yeah. They hate niggas Let like me. Let me tell you something. I, 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 I won't even choice. try to, listen. My listen, body, my choice. I won't even try to fuck you the first night. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm with that. You. I'm with I that. I will later with you and cuddle. Yeah, they, they, they be wanting a little bit like, hold on. Ooh, yeah. yeah. It's special. This special. Ooh. If you got time. Cuddle without sex. Nah, I'm a bad motherfucker, bro. Ooh, you cold. That's really not that hard. My dick get the rising. Nah. That's if, okay. That's, that's okay. okay. Go the fuck to sleep. Please. Because I'm telling you that next day on my mama. She going to be day, on it like, okay, the, he the, wouldn't need The pussy ain't never been more guaranteed, nigga. Wait wait out a night. He's right. Wait out a mm. night. See, wait. me, I'm the type of nigga. I like, I like, I be keeping it two player. I be uh, leaving. Like, not on some what? player shit, though. Like, on some, like, I, we have a good time. Uh-huh. Boop, I drop you off back to the spot. Hug, grab that ass. Mm-hmm. All right, move, I'm going to tap in with you. And keep it player. Like, okay. I don't even want you to think you can... Like how you holding out on that pussy? I'm holding out on this no, dick. You don't I'm make going home. No, it's you don't really make them. A... You don't make them feel like they holding out on it. Because mm-hmm. if you don't even try to get none, how you it, know if they holding natural. out on it? Don't mm-hmm. even try to get none. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? You know what but I'm that's saying? why I go home. No, you don't, don't think go I'm home. trying to hit no. if I go in the house and lay Hell with your no. ass. You got to dangle it in the whole face. No, but you this gotta, is the thing, though. If you show, if you show, you got that self control. It's different, bro. Mm. If you sure you got self control, you hot. sure. And the man, you ain't got no self control. You ready? It's like, oh, you thirsty. You do this with everybody. You do this with everybody. Yeah. And now I feel like it is a company by base basis. Yeah. Yeah. So I feel you, like you gotta, got a whole regiment. You gotta. If you can show a chick like I could just chill with you, bro. That that pussy yours and mine. That's real game. I feel you on that, but I, I like the one. I don't like. I'm not. I be hesitant on pulling up and spending a night and all that. It's like if I feel like I'm comfortable enough to spend a night, I'm comfortable enough to have sex with you. If I don't want to, if I'm not trying to fuck, I don't want to spend a night because I don't want you to think no, bro, I'm you, that gullible. Here's the thing. You are trying to fuck. You just not trying to fuck tonight. Exactly. You laying a foundation. So you mm. go, you go, you mm. spend a night. You vibe. Y'all have fun. Y'all talk. Y'all laugh. Do you, Bro, let me tell you something. Women, mm. bro, women like to be... They, bro, they like to they like they like to be wanted, but they don't like to be hunted on. So like they want to. is the key word. These they, niggas are hunters they out here. Hunters, bro. And they it's so the vagina them, is the key. So you want them? If you yeah. show them, I want you. But I'm patient enough for you to, bro. Pussy ain't, ain't pussy ain't the best pussy is when they give it to you. Mm. But why Not is that, everything come a game on, man, though? Come like, on, it gets good to me. I, I already why, get some strategy, money before the sex. What's the strategy about when it comes to women? What's what's the strategy? I feel like y'all sometimes want to be used by these mm-hmm. hoes. And that's why y'all ended up having to come up with a game plan. Because if mm-hmm. you really vibing with a girl mm-hmm. and y'all be like, oh, okay, y'all drinking, whatever, it's going to end up happening. And if not today, the next day. It's I not, never. Y- he over here like, okay, so what you going to do is mm-hmm. game. Like, it shouldn't be no I, game I, plan. I don't think it's that. I think, I <laughs> he think, did map out a whole game plan. Go to sleep. <laughs> listen. Close your eyes for about 30 minutes. <laughs> listen, bro, listen. Then the pussy going to get wet. And listen. then you act like you don't want to fuck. Bro, listen. Listen. The bottle, not the listen. second one, but the third one from the back. Let me and then we going to like. Let me this thing got a game plan. It sound good, bro. Let me tell you. I'm gonna tell you why you gotta have a game plan, bro. Because she can sit there and say all that shit, but women have a game plan. Mm. Anytime a woman know in her mind, I'm not fucking him tonight. No, I'm. I'm I may gonna. Not know. I'm gonna. I, these are the things that I'm gonna do to make sure I don't fuck him. I'm gonna sleep fully clothed. I'm gonna put on this. I'm gonna wear. Make sure I got panties. I'm gonna make sure, bro. Women do shit like that all the time to show give you a Just sign that know. is ugly so period they, panties so and all they, that shit so if they plan like, like if they strategically trying to stop you from getting the pussy <laughs> mm-hmm. why won't you strategically put a plan together to get the pussy if you want it mm-hmm. That if they stop you from getting it, it don't. It's really simple. It's mm-hmm. just being human. Mm-hmm. That's all it is. It's just being human, bro. I've never it's not done a, that. Like you, though, if I'm spending a night at a man's house, I'm not, the intention is not like, oh, I'm a hold out or whatever. If I'm spending a night over this man's house, it's a chance I might fuck this man. I think you know everybody, I think now, it's in the back of everybody's head. Go home, sis. If, man, if listen you, to me. If you ain't trying to fuck, go home. Just go home. You male or surprised. female. Give, give yeah. Take your home. ass to the house. Yeah, unless y'all playing board games. But that is a good ass. Cool. I'm going to have to try it. Bro, listen unless to me. Unless you end up I'm like. I'm going to tell you something. I can already tell you a smooth ass nigga, bro. Mm-hmm. I can Appreciate already that, tell, P. Bro. Take one to know one. Take one to know one. I can already tell. And I'm going to tell you something right now. If you implement patience into your game, bro, bro, you're going to separate yourself from the pack, bro. Facts. You gotta separate yourself from the pack. It don't make you a bad nigga, bro, because you lay up with a chick and yeah. not try to fuck her. It's cool to vibe with a chick. It's you cool. might end up liking her. You know what I'm saying? Mm. 
you might end up fucking but this with is, her. You should already know if you gonna like this girl before she pull up to the crib. So y'all don't care if y'all like the bitch. Y'all ready to fuck, suck, all the That's shit. why I ain't fucking on the first it's, night. I need to get to know you a little bit. But see, that's why I don't even want to come in on the first night because I don't want you to think is you can get me when you want but me. But see, everybody's scared of getting each other at this point. Like I just want right. to like I just want to go back to when it was about family farming and hunting with for the food Man, and, and having the kids and bearing the children. Cause everybody just out here like, okay, she trying to be a tree. He trying to be a. I ain't giving. It's just all so transactional. No, I just bro. need some real. What I didn't say was this. I just need something what real. What I didn't say was this. Now, if you go spend a night, mm -hmm. all right, you go spend a night. I'm not saying, just because I say don't try. Now, if she try, mm -hmm. nigga, then you lay there. You split rows, nigga, play sleep. Let her pull your pants down. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, nigga? When she get right here by that waist, lift your ass up. Like, wake up, talking about, man, what you doing? You know what I'm saying? You play the role. If she going to go, if she going to go, then, yeah. then, then, then go. But what I'm saying is, you should never be the aggressor. Never, never, never be, never be the reason why it happened. Because women the next day would be like, "Damn, I shouldn't have did that. I should have." You never want them to feel like that. Hell you yeah. You want them to feel. You want them to feel good about that decision yeah. to get that pussy you up. You want like, them to want to do it again. Yeah. You feel me? Right. That's why a lot of niggas only be fucking chicks once. Exactly. See, I don't want nothing that don't want me. You understand Period. me? <laughs> yeah, baby. Yeah. You we you ain't fucking me and I ain't fucking you. We fucking each other. <laughs> right. Yeah, baby. Right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I like oh, it. mama. Is we rolling right now? Yeah, we just popping shit. Oh, putting right. paint okay. in. Okay. You understand me? Like, yeah, man. Right. We it's the Kelly kickback, you understand <laughs> me? It's your boy Lewis Bell. We back. You understand me? I got another special guest in the building, you understand me? Uh, all the way from Chicago. Y'all know him from the videos and all this shit, man. I'm personally a fan, bro. I've been watching I've been watching you for about a about a year and I've been laughing at your shit. And the only reason I could solidify I'm, I'm a fan or not though. Cause I ain't seen that stand up. Damn. And I seen it last night. And okay. you go crazy. You official. The one and only Mojo Brooks in this yeah, thing. I heard him. I'm official. I'm a fan too. All right. Oh, oh, you oh, yeah, remind no. me of my ex boyfriend. Oh, <laughs> he do. That nigga toxic. Thing. No, it's a bad thing. Oh, that's yeah. He bad. done showed up to the door. Everything. Pop, but this pop, nigga pop, toxic. Broken. I can tell by his videos. I am. I be watching. I am yeah, toxic. And that's okay. I'm toxic, but I just found out recently that I'm really, like, I just found out recently that I'm, that I'm really toxic. But, like, I don't really I'm only toxic because I don't give a, I don't give a fuck as much as like people think like women see the videos and they be like oh this nigga mm -hmm. and then when they fuck with me mm -hmm. and then like I don't be doing all that shit like I don't I don't give a fuck and that's, I, I think they want to shot of entertainers yeah, I ain't no, right. we got yeah. we got Jordan Lucas in the building too you understand me uh play girl from the Bay Girl <laughs> yeah, yeah. City shit she did. you like that one yeah. that was my first time Girl, ever using it. it is. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? A little red bone. You know, nice oh, little tone with the red you bone. Know, you know, you see. Yeah, you know. Uh, hey, you good on TikTok, bro? I'm not, I cannot get yanking on TikTok, bro. Hey, they be flagging all my shit. Nigga, I, what I learned is. But at first they was they because of the cursing they would take me down. So yeah, then I was just censored it, bro. I just bleep out the curse words. Oh, you bro. just bleep it out. And I'm gonna tell you something. The people on there, the people on there, bro, they still gonna they know what you're trying to say. Oh, okay. They know what you got, and, and honestly, bro, TikTok the easiest platform to to um, grow a fan to grow base. on, bro. I For grew sure. up, bro. I've been on Instagram since 2012. Mm -hmm. I think I just hit 500k. Yeah, I've been on. TikTok, bro, since the pandemic, 2023, yeah, I'm at 800,000. Yeah, because how many followers you got? You got hella followers. I'm like 971,000, almost at a million. Go on, but shout I me have, out. You don't have to have, <laughs> you stupid. You don't have to censor your videos. I got a little trick for that. What's the trick? Are you, look, I can say it. We yeah, some game. Tell them, yeah. Okay, free game. game. All you got to do is put the music behind it, turn the music off, and it's a wrap. You can post whatever you want to post. So put Wait, that, that long, Just don't have no, you know, Gucci, no Nick, no digging balls. You good. Wait, so put the put some music behind the yes, video. Yes, I always choose a song that goes. Okay, so this is what some of my supporters love. I always choose a song title that goes with it. So if I'm talking about spending money, I'll do like cash flow or something like that. Something mm -hmm. that you know oh, makes sense. Okay. Turn that, turn it down, and it don't flag you. Even on your funny videos, when you yeah. be funny, it be music in the back. Y yes, but I she just, just turned turn the volume down. It's off. That shit work? Because they used to community guidelines See, me know. all the she time. Know. She know. She big on TikTok, too. That's what I'm saying. See, see, that's why I'm like, I probably, that's why yeah. I just seen. I'm like, man, yeah, she TikTok. Bro. She, the, she, bro, I'm I, she they was they doing my fun. videos. Yeah. They Women, the fun. I'm TikTok telling you. TikTok is fun. It is. TikTok Instagram, they bougie. Everywhere else is just, they TikTok, they, what's it called? They engage with you. They talk to you. But you have 10,000 comments on TikTok. And then they got you really feeling famous, too. 
because this the most I've been recognizing my entire life. I said, hold on. <laughs> it's motherfucking looking at me. I'm like, bitch, what's up? They like, I love you. I'm like, well, I asked a okay. nigga at the airport yeah. in Chicago, bro. When I was getting ready to come out here, I'm walking and he just he just staring at me. So I I'm Nervous looking back at him. Bit. I'm mm-hmm. look I'm staring back at him and the shit. Start to last too long for my liking. Yeah. So I asked him, I said, hey, bro, you you good? Yeah, my bad, bro. I, I Man, I just I just can't believe it's you, man. I, I mean, I just seen you on TikTok and shit like that. I said, nigga, wave next time or something, yeah, bro. Yeah, you could have got me and feel like this a problem. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, But it's fun, though. It's dope. They the most interactive in person, I feel like. Yeah. yeah. You yeah, just got back too. from Miami, right? I did get back from Miami. How was that? <laughs> Oh, I had a ball. I had a motherfucking ball. Yeah. Anytime I went to Miami, it was with a nigga. So I mm. never had got the real experience because I was booed up, you know, just personal stuff. Mm. But now this was the time I was with my homegirls. Don't tell me ass. you gave that pussy away. No, in Miami. oh, no, no. I didn't give up a single bit of coochie. Not the left lip or the right lip, nigga. I ain't even get no head sad. I was gonna say, did you give out a little head I, or something? I, I didn't even get no head. I should have oh, left okay. with some head. But <laughs> ladies, I, y'all can <laughs> know, know something, ladies. If y'all can't get nothing else in life, y'all can get always some get some head. It's yeah. always a nigga. You have you ever gave a female some some head I would and, fucking and, never. And, and, I would know you ain't got. You ass. already know. I done fucking did that. I done, did, I done got some head and bounce. Uh-uh, I yeah. feel like a women nigga. be saying that so shit. Them bitches trying to hold. Them bitches be trying to pull up their pants. Hold on, bitch. Whoa, 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 whoa. I said whoa, I'm gonna be right uh-uh. back. I said, I said I'm gonna be right back. He was like, for sure. I a nigga, never, you told a nigga you would be yeah, right oh, back. and He went for it. It was a goal of mine. 2023, you gonna get some head and you bounce on these niggas. I did. It felt so good. You wasn't scared. That's <laughs> like a dangerous game. <laughs> like, that's like niggas, a hit and run. Niggas get strong. Dude, niggas get strong. Yeah. No. But ain't nothing worse uh-huh. than seeing a bitch trying to, uh-uh, whoa, whoa, what you doing? Uh-uh. Have a female that's attempted take, that on you? Bro, I take, let me tell you something, bro. <laughs> I'm going to let you know something right now. I'm 33, bro. I learned all the techniques when I was younger, bro. Techniques. First of all, bro, you never even get in a situation. First of all, if you gave us some head, Mm-hmm. And she was able to put her clothes on after that. Mm-hmm. You didn't eat that motherfucker good enough. That's 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 right. one. Right. That's one. That's one. She should want to fuck after you do after you've been a dead that. Rule number two is when you take her clothes off, throw that shit across the room. <laughs> <laughs> so that way, so that way, if a bitch thinks she wanna just get up and get dressed. We, right. we got time to talk before you get that over nigga, there and find That nigga eating pussy with the female drawers on yeah. his foot. Right. I'm, you know pushing that that I'm pushing them up. I'm pushing them up. You hear he said technique. He, he's serious about He got about a plan. This, he, this he, part he, of the plan. Rule number three. As you eating a pussy, <laughs> you should be quietly removing your own clothes. <laughs> she shouldn't even hear you pulling them bitches down. Rule number four. Uh, after as soon as she come, you feel her coming, uh-huh. you slide right up, put dick in. Soon as soon as you, you feel that shaking, you slide up, kiss on her mouth, put dick in. What's what, what's gonna See, happen? I'm after so that? fast with it. You just <laughs> sound that sound like a good plan. That's a technique, bro. I'm telling you right now. But he Free didn't. Game. That nigga didn't. He didn't. He no, didn't. I'm not he, gonna lie. He did his motherfucking big ones. I told you it was a goal though of mine. So I just had to. So go back to your point. Women be having a plan. You see what I'm what, saying? It was one nigga. You see what I'm saying? Damn, I get my rock off. You see what I'm, I'm saying? I'm peeping game. You see what I'm saying? And they try to they try to make it seem like we the problem because because we be. You know what I'm saying? Putting our no, shit in, me, in, in, in order. Some men I do not have a strategy with. I really just want to come and have something real for real. You got to tell a nigga that, though. Be like, hey, I don't oh, want to oh, do I'm, that. Yeah, I'm telling them. Okay. I feel like every female say that. No, I keep so no, I keep some one hundred because I I'm afraid of rejection myself. Mm-hmm. So I don't need a nigga telling me no, what I can't do, what he not gonna do. I'd rather we just be honest and upfront and keep it pee. Yeah, genuinely. But that's wow. That was dangerous. What you did. That's it, was, it was. It was. What I ran. I was like, if it, I did the whole oh, nine, it was. That fun. nigga was calling your phone and everything. Yeah. Where you at? Oh yeah. No, he's still calling my phone though. Well, it right might be to kill me. Hey. That's <laughs> what I'm saying. Yeah. You on the run now? You, on that, right. that nigga's just sitting in the room right now, smelling his top lip. <laughs> I bet you I come back. Yeah. Bro, he's sick. Hella funny, ain't nothing, bro. I'ma tell you something. Ain't nothing worse than being close. And he was like so close, like I mean, he gave you some head and ain't here. That yeah. shit gonna be on it, that nigga can go right now and hit Beyonce. And that shit's still gonna be on. That's right? what I'm saying. I, I had to leave an people, impression. I don't know how people get head and put a condom on. Right, it's backwards because you already got it. It's all you already yeah. in your mouth, right? Yeah. It's Do people mouth. y'all get head and put a condom on? I can't do that shit. No, I feel like uh, that if is I get a head, I don't have to get wrong. You talking about if so I receive the head? No, I'm. Uh, I'm talking about if you if give, you give head. head. Yeah. If I give head, if I give you some head, I feel like I'm entitled to hit that thing wrong just because <laughs> I didn't my mouth. That's how because you know niggas now be so scared of eating coochie. This is like grow up. 
niggas. <laughs> nah, I be, I be fake Some scared. Niggas, not scared. the niggas I, I deal with, because that's mandatory. He's 28, though. I'm 28. I yeah. still, my mouth, I, how I treat my mouth how women be trying to treat their vagina. Yeah. I be like, this <laughs> this is something special. Head for me is mandatory. Yeah. If it's I give you some head, bitch, I damn near fake mini love you. Yeah. That's, what, that's how the new rocking. niggas yeah. think. The new niggas yeah. is like, if I give you head, you're everything to me. Like, yeah, yeah no. You I my you my little baby. You feel me? My mama, bitch. What? I'm 33. You didn't pay. You didn't pay for some shit. You want some head? If you, you want some head, head you, if you want some head, if you want some head, you gonna have to get some head. I'm letting you know that right now. Right. You gonna have to get some head. So, <sighs> you know, and I don't like to. Me personally, I don't like. I don't. I don't. I don't. First of all, anybody, I don't eat air pussy. I deal That's with. That's what I'm you should, saying. But you shouldn't be, as a woman, you shouldn't be giving head to, to any, any nigga man. anyway. But if mm-hmm. it's a girl that I really like, I'm really feeling her. Like That's I, I'm, I'm gonna give you some head. Because it's it's gonna it's gonna heighten the sexual experience. You see what Women need all that. Head is a feeling. It is like you gotta want to do it. Yeah, you feel me? Like yeah, you can't want to do it. You can't just you can't just you can't not give head because you want to have sex. Right. Nah, right. That's if I just want to do that, I'm not giving you no head. Yeah, or sometimes yeah. head turn you on. Head, head giving head, started. giving head make you want to. I can't just. I'm up. selfish. It be I be hard get my dick suck. Yeah, I'm one of the nigga. I get sucked and it be like, all right, come on, get up on this mom. I heard. Yeah, that's I what I'm talking about. about. That's the hot. Head, though. That's hot. The head. Really? I, don't, I yeah. can't come from head. Do like it's like oh shit. It's hella niggas that be saying that. Yeah, I like that as a woman because then I feel like you got. To come up off something and you can run it back. Yeah. Three making me feel like three minutes. Yeah, but I, Mojo, like, bro, I swear, you a bad I, get suck. I, I know. <laughs> I think I really know how to get. Like receive head. You gotta <laughs> relax. T- you gotta relax. That's what my, my homeboy was like. He said, Mojo, you, you probably not relax. You trying to fuck? Y'all you be, you I, got I, your ass hella tight getting sucked. <laughs> you ain't gonna know. Wait, wait. I got a good question for y'all. You gotta relax. Y'all, y'all getting y'all ass a? All right, this shit going too far. What? Ass ate. Yeah, get, are you getting your ass ate? Gabrielle, you ain't said she get. Oh, now he got the glasses on. I know that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Gabrielle, you, hey, as the niggas, you put your legs up, cock in the back, and seeing what it do real quick. Uh, Hell look, no. Let you me can, tell look, see, he a grown nigga. I I'm know keep, that's right. I'm going to keep it real. I'm give give it us real. that technique. I'm going to keep it real. All right. Uh, I, I didn't hear that happen to me before. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Your legs in the sky. Now, I'm going to tell you, I'm a real nigga. Oh, you, had a arch, you had an arch with it? No. Oh, okay. I'm a real nigga. So. The way you gotta do it, you gotta receive it like you don't really want it, but you're cool. <laughs> so, you know how I how I get it, like you know they, you know she'll be hitting the ball, and what you do is you kind of like you, you know, ain't gotta you, show us all the way, man. No, nah, I'm gonna show. Yeah. Right. Yeah, <laughs> that nigga you, finna, that nigga finna get naked. So you what sl- you gotta do <laughs> is you gotta slouch <laughs> up and you okay. put that, you raise that right. leg up. You don't, uh-huh. you 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 only gotta go about twenty degrees. Uh-huh. You so raise about right that here? leg, yeah, right here. Now uh-huh. what you don't don't let no bitch push your That's leg. That's what back. I'm saying. No, you just <laughs> lift up a little bit enough with her, to, you know, to get up in there and do her shit, and you know what I'm saying. Now you gotta let her hit that motherfucker, eat that motherfucker, hit that motherfucker like that. <laughs> right, yeah, my mama. Mm-hmm. Now, what you mean, right? I'm just I heard you things. Eat ass? No, I heard things. I fuck I fuck with the she little eat- gooch shit. <laughs> the gooch is cool. You ain't wrong though. The I gooch is things. cool. That's fine. I but, mean that's amateur. But how you getting your gooch done though? You gotta you gotta raise that leg a little you bit. You don't gotta the raise that leg. My you ain't balls, like this. You not like this. My balls hang. <laughs> so you can lift the motherfuckers up. Oh. Lift it up. Okay. Oh, go crazy. Jack. Oh, go crazy. And then get back to the movement. Nah, man. Go ahead, bro. Look. <laughs> Nigga, you going places in life, bro. <laughs> you stupid. You should be able to receive everything that's out here for you, bro. Because I find, understand, like, you can let grow. These girls, yeah. like, don't do it. Don't don't ask for it, though. Yeah, don't. I mean, now that's some freaky shit. Like, I get it, my bro. ass say, I would look at a nigga like, whoa. And you, you think this, this is yeah, some, yeah. Y'all think this is something that's new? That people no, all man, niggas no. been getting their ass ate since the sixties, man. Oh, I thought, yeah, maybe even before then. Maybe, I'm just saying, we just as know long five as motherfuckers done had holes and everything, it's. Everybody always looking for the new thing. Mm-hmm. Something new. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Niggas been getting their ass ate, bro. <laughs> Maybe they, they just wasn't talking about it. They weren't talking about it, bro. But now, you know, motherfuckers is comfortable with who they are. Yeah. I know all I like is pussy. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, I, I, I'm comfortable with it. I, it, didn't, it didn't happen to me. Oh, mother. You know what I'm saying? I, I didn't ask for it. I don't go around asking Look, he's for like, it. I didn't ask for it. You know what I'm saying? I like, didn't go and ask for it. For example, she eat ass, right? Is it oh, wait, hold on. And you already I, told us. I, did yeah, say, I can tell. I did not say. Ass. I wouldn't ask this woman. If I met this woman, I wouldn't <laughs> ask her, do you eat that? I wouldn't ask her none of that. That's if right. we just got into that moment where, you know, shit was going on and she and she she they let you know what's up. When they get down by that gooch, you'll feel that tongue go down there and swipe That's your ass. That's what my a little friends bit. told me. That's yeah. what they told me. Mm-hmm. Happens. 
Your friends probably know how to go crazy then. That's, they what, told I, her. that's what I told oh, her. They told me they told I, me I like about that the 20 degrees in the legs. Out. They told me about that Let technique. Let me join that motherfucking group. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mama. Y'all talking about giving head. This is yeah. a great conversation. So y'all let me ask you this, it. Louis, then, because you already said, you said, you know what I'm saying, you skeptical. You know what I mean? You be a little bit scared to eat a little pussy. Mm-hmm. Do you eat ass? Nah, nah, I'm bummed. You don't what? eat ass? You got to think about it. I'm already pump faking with the eating coochie type what? shit. Yeah, I'm bunk. I, I know you lie. eat ass. I know he eat ass. ass. The way Mojo cocked him with yeah. to the yeah. side, I know that's right. Yeah. Take some whole face in the ass. Oh! Yeah. Why not? What is we? Why not? Put your face in you the ass. You gotta tell these youngins to, to grow up. That's Louis, I'm telling you right now, I'm gonna see this nigga uh, about five years from now. Man, this nigga we gonna, gonna, be gonna have together. to follow he up. He gonna be a professional ass nigga. Like, man, man, Mojo, man, bitch. I my think ass. I'm a little selfish. I think I think I be. I think women be satisfied with my penis. I can be delusional. But uh, I be you feeling, wanted them. I, I'm like, one I'm of them. Like I'm enough. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. It's enough. I, I ain't got no complaints. Mm-hmm. So if it ain't broke, don't fix it. But you, but you can add to the experience. Oh, I can add. That's what I'm. Okay. okay. See, no, I can't. Yeah, you feel it me? It gotta be. An it's experience. like a joke. It's yeah. like you know yeah. what I'm saying. Nigga. Yeah, it my gotta be good. Yeah. Add, give me the tag. Yeah, yeah, nigga, I got jokes on there. Yeah. I know some. I know some men be feeling weird. Eating ass and shit like that. You don't need to tag. I don't need to. But if you put them bitches on there, a set gonna be fine. Crazy. It's the same with toys. You know, some men be feeling a little weird about the toys, but really that'll you know. What you now? Nah, you on them. some other shit now? Now I ain't gonna you lie. ain't never used no toys. I put that rose on my That's balls one time. Wait, wait, on oh, your balls? Yeah. Okay, now he's wacko. Hell yeah. Wacko jackal. I'm talking Hell about you putting it on put her. the rose on the balls. <laughs> Man, it worked. Tell you something, boy, it worked. How? Boy, 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 that was a twerker later right there, boy. <laughs> 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 hey, hey, look, look, look. Because what you do <laughs> is you have the rose while you hitting her. Uh-huh. You supposed to put the rose on, on her. her. Uh-huh. Put the rose on her. I had a chick take the rose. While I had it on her, she took it from me. She put it on my balls. Oh, wow. she was going crazy. Yeah, and it feels now good. She next level. Yeah, yeah. she went it crazy. Feels, right. It feels good. It Damn. feels good. But that's like that with the toys. I do that. Like I put the rose, or you know what I'm saying. I uh, you know, I am, you know. Them Chicago niggas be freaky. Oh yeah. no, I heard, I heard about, about y'all. I about Chicago. I heard about All y'all. Them niggas yeah. is nasty. We'll tell y'all about us. <laughs> we'll tell y'all about us. We ain't ashamed of okay. shit. I lead her. You know what I'm saying. Ooh. I lead her was nasty. You know what I'm saying. Okay. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> no, he was the nastiest. He said, he said, that they said our hog time. He was hog time, bitches. He was hog time, bitches. I like that. I'm into that, though. I like to. I the, just picked me up a little hog time. I got the Western name. And shit. Oh, I'm I got the bondage strap. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. That's, yeah, that's, yeah, that's I like that's my How shit. you feel about the West Coast? You be coming out here or are you new to coming out you here to the what? West Coast? You know what? I just really started coming out this way. Like, I I did um I did Tommy T's mm-hmm. a couple months ago. Man, y'all different than a motherfucker out here, man. Yeah. Like, I thought about moving out here. I thought about moving to L.A. This was probably like a year ago. This is when I first had really had met you. Mm-hmm. And I was standing, we was down on uh, down in Hollywood, man. I'm standing out there, and I'm seeing all these motherfuckers out there like zombies walking around. And this one came, that motherfucker came running up at me full speed. Uh-huh. Full <laughs> speed. Lay, I laid that motherfucker out. The nigga that I was with, he was like, no, he wasn't going to do nothing to you. I said, well, he wasn't moving like... Yeah. He wasn't moving like he wasn't gonna do nothing to me. Like, no, nah, you know, a lot of people out here on, on drugs and shit like that. And they, you know, they fucked up. And I'm like, oh, I can't be that. What's down the difference here. between the homeless people out. in Chicago? They ain't zombies, G. Them is crackheads, bro. These motherfuckers down here, y'all, mm-hmm. they on something else, bro. They be out is here. Is Hollywood crackheads different from Bay Area crackheads? Yeah, we got knocks. Them motherfuckers. Right. Yeah, yeah, we got shit like yeah. how Chicago is. I our, see what you're saying. Our niggas in the Bay will talk to you, though, and see what they can get out you. Like, nigga, you got that TV still? Yeah, yeah, t- they on some yeah. knocks. Them niggas shit. down, yeah. they don't talk. Them motherfuckers don't oh, talk, though. If they do, they talking to themselves. Yeah, I see. That what shit you be said. weird, bro. Yeah. Like, yeah. It, it, like, they ain't, we got regular knock uncle. Like, they like uncles, right. but they a little off. They part of the community. <laughs> this shit out right, here, bro. They part of the community. Bro, these yeah. motherfuckers that came out here, bro, and chased the dream. Yeah. It ain't work out. They done got hooked on drugs, bro. Facts. And they done, not only have they, they, they health is declining because of the drugs, they done lost their mind because right. of the, because of the, the dream, shit, the dream that, that, that they chased that they didn't get. It's a lot, bro. Like, yeah. that, that's a lot. It, and it's just different down here. But, what I can say is, though, like it's way like from Chicago. Like it's it seems like everything is like way more together. Even when I was at the comedy club last night, I just seen a lot of the comedians like they, you know, it was love. It's like, hey man, what's up? You know what I'm saying? And even you know niggas I never met before was was talking to me like we known each other, uh, you know, okay, our whole lives. Dope. But I, I fucked with that vibe. It ain't seen fake. It ain't seen phony. Um, 
So, you know, that's kind of what I like about it. It's just saying, like, every, I've been in the chocolate Sundays. Mm -hmm. Everything just saying, like, it don't be seeming like niggas be hating on each other. And if they is hating it, like, it, it must be, like, that's why. Tip. That's why it's fake. Because yeah. the hate, it come with a smile on their face. Yeah. Feel me? Versus yeah. Oakland, the Bay Area, Chicago. Yeah. Nigga, the hate, you feel it. You feel it, yeah. Nigga, if a nigga, it's a problem, it's a problem, you gonna feel you it. You gonna feel it. Versus out here, it, you... People that come from that type of environment don't like it because we not used to that. We used right. to real love. Real love, yeah. Right. And real hate. And real hate, These yeah. niggas out here be on some love hate. Love hate, no, that, yeah. That so that's actually confusing. deep, though. It's yeah. real love or real hate. For yeah. No, that's exactly. real shit, though, because yeah. that's what we used to. We know when a nigga don't like us. Exactly. That nigga don't like me. We know it. Yep. That nigga let you know. Yep. He'll let you know in a subtle way, I don't really fuck with you like that, and that's cool. Thanks for letting me know. And like, like, like I said, it's out here just saying like everybody, like everybody love each other. Yeah, yeah. You know, no, and like, ain't no way everybody feel this yeah, way about that's each what other. Yeah. That's why I take my ass back to the bay. Right, and get some of that homegrown. We we yeah. definitely different from LA though, even though we all on the West Coast. Yeah, yeah. it's it's a different vibe. But I like it out. I'm gonna tell you something. I like it out here. I feel like the women out this way, they like way more free and willing to fuck. You know what I'm saying? Mm. I feel like women way, you know, coming back towards the East and in the Midwest, like you know, they they. You know, they, 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 you know, be wanting to play a little hard with the pussy. But out here, it's like everybody. Well, I went to San Diego one time. Oh, shout out San Diego. Man, they fucks in like, San Diego. San Diego? They fucks in San Diego. It's some bad bitches in San Diego, what? too. They fucks in San Diego. San Diego don't get the credit they deserve. They don't. They don't. <laughs> They don't. In Sacramento, too. People be sleeping on Sacramento. You got to go out there. Because it ain't the Bay and it ain't L.A., but it's California. It ain't hella right. fast, but it ain't hella slow. Yeah. Sacramento right. a good city. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I yeah. will be out yeah. there on uh, the 16th, brother. <laughs> yeah, yeah, go yeah. get those tickets. I yeah. love everybody. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's funny. He's still <laughs> no, but that's, that, you know, I think the women out this way, are like, they way more chill. They way more cool. Um. But mm -hmm. you know. I ain't gonna lie. I uh I, I see what you're saying uh about the different coasts, like with the women and shit. I feel like, and when we speak of LA, till we talking about Hollywood, we ain't talking about the real LA, yeah. right? Because the real about, LA and, and the Bay got a lot of shit in common. Okay, outside right. of the gang banging shit. Okay, but you know what I'm saying? This Hollywood shit, this some whole different other yeah. shit. A yeah, whole different ball game. Yeah, yeah. Atlanta kind of getting like that too, though. Atlanta like Hollywood, I, but I it's like, like black people. Atlanta, Atlanta it's black fun. Hollywood. I fuck with that shit. Atlanta fun. I ain't, you know, I ain't never went to Atlanta and like really had no good ass time. Really? Every time I go there, <laughs> it like it be for work. Yeah. And then you be so scared, you know what I'm saying, to really have fun out there. You got to be on your piece of cute for yeah, sure. Right. So Atlanta just, I don't know. Now, I'm going to tell y'all where it's at. Where? Like where it's a real good time at. Houston. Houston. I love Houston though. Houston is the best time. The niggas is fine. The bitches is fine. Shit, the animals is fine. Everybody is lit out there. Like Houston they got, is a good they time. got brunch spots. Yes. It never closes. The, it just it Houston just, it's is the new Atlanta. That's, everybody yeah. moving there because you got to think Houston got its own culture, its own people that go the crazy. Rent is hella and cheap. Everybody moving out there too. So bro, it's like yeah. they, it's a bro. It's just it's it's so big. Yeah. One, it's so big. It's always something to do. Um. Nigga, they, they got a good comedy scene down there. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, shout out my boy yeah. J. Ken, man. Yes, that's my boy. Yeah, my boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. J. Ken, yo. That's my boy. Yeah. But it's some real, it's some. It's a nice comedy scene down there, bro. It, it's just a, it's a nice city. Like, I like San Antonio. I've never been to San Antonio. I've only been San Antonio, once, Antonio really, go. No, I ain't seen it. I ain't, I'm going to say San Antonio, see. go. You went? I've been once. Okay, so that this must be go. a comedian thing, because I ain't, I ain't had no business down there. Yeah, Dallas go crazy. Dallas I love go, Dallas. Dallas got the brunch. I just like Texas. Texas. I Dallas. think I just like Texas. Yeah. Texas is nice. Austin remind me too much of Bay Area. Does it? I yeah. like Austin, though. Austin remind Austin me of San Jose. Some, Austin got some okay, bad hoes. It's like San Jose. Yeah. There's some bad hoes in Austin. Yeah, it is. Some stars in Austin. What? Yeah. Some yeah. stars in what? Yeah. In Austin? Y'all putting me on today. Austin. There's some stars in Austin. We talking about some crazy shit right like now. Austin what are we talking about? In. We talking about where the baddest bitch is. I'm like, Austin, yeah. tap in. She in on it, too. She got <laughs> Austin. All these hoes in Austin. Right. I'm yeah. feeling the technique, Mojo. Man, look, I'll, not the technique. Yeah, I'm feeling the technique, man. Mojo. How do you come up with your skits, man? Bro, First I'm of all, how long you been doing it? Um, when did you start doing your skits? Bro, I've been, I've been doing this shit, bro, since 2014. And I then did a little bit of everything. I, early on, I was doing like a lot of character work. I used to do this old nigga named Mr. James that used to be tricking off on y'all, <laughs> Sugar Daddy. Mm -hmm. And that shit was big. That's kind of like what sprung me out. And then, you know, I noticed with character work is once you start doing character shit, you get, they, 
they'll you'll get stuck in boxed it. in right. and yep. everything that you got to do it got to be about this character people always asking what a character at. so i was kind of like stuck bro i was stagnant for a long time where like people knew me but i like they just knew me as that so i had to step out of that i had to find a way to step out of it mm-hmm. and i started doing like the um the ring camera shit mm-hmm. and that, was that shit was like an instant it was just like an instant hit and it it instantly separated me how do you do the ring camera thing like how how, how did that how did you create that and how because it's basically you record yourself on a ring camera yeah and you and you making up a uh it's like a skit right it ain't yeah. real right yeah, it's not real. Yeah, yeah yeah so so pretty much so i'm gonna tell you how it started so i was doing this um i was at this concert we do this concert in chicago every year called the big jam and Lil dirk was headlining this this, this concert and he was the first artist from Chicago to ever headline this concert. This is like our biggest concert. Oh, okay. So Dirk was doing it, and he proposed to India oh, that on, that, on that, on that, on that, show. on that, sh- at that show. So after that, I'm like, bro, all the all the females gonna be like, they man need to be coming like this, woo woo. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, man, I'm gonna do a video about this. Mm-hmm. So the next day, I'm like, man, I'm gonna go like I'm going to my girl crib. Like, man, you see what happened with Dirk and India? Like that could have been us. <laughs> so I went, I went about this ring from Walmart. It was like six ninety nine. It was big as hell on the on the on the thing. And I'm holding the ring up to the doorbell and shit like that. And I'm like, just give me another chance. Think you know. You seen what just happened with Dirk and India, and bam, that shit went viral. Damn. And then after that, I was gonna leave it alone. After that, motherfuckers was like, man, do another one, do another one. So I did another one. Then I did another one. And then I started looking at the parts that they were saying like that they really like. Oh, I'm like, oh, they like when I be turning up on this bitch. Right. All right, let me turn up. Mm-hmm. So then I started doing that, and then bam, y'all the first people I'ma tell this to. Mm-hmm. So Lil Dirk just reached out to me two weeks ago, right? That's raw. Right? Uh-huh. And Y'all know him in India, they... Right. Yeah. Shout out India. Yeah. I love her. She's a yeah. supporter of mine. <laughs> so, so, um, damn, I don't know if I could tell this. You could tell it? I'm going to tell it offline. Oh! <laughs> that's how you can't do that. Give us a hand. Give us a hand. The whole order fans is going to be like, you got to have a lot of thought right I'm now. I'm going to tell you what. Y'all going to see it. I, oh. I might Look, because look, I was talk, me, we was talking today, right? Uh-huh. Me and I was talking today. And I, I'll show you. Uh-huh. I'll show you, gang. But, damn. Uh, I ain't going to lie. I'll be doing that. But... um. I don't know, man. I gotta stop. I feel him because I be doing that shit too. Yeah, yeah dude, you know you I had to hold that house party movie in for two years, nigga. Bro, and I, bro, I shot bro, that shit two me. years ago. When I saw the shit, right? <laughs> when when I saw it, I went to the movie theater. I had just talked to Hot Davis, <laughs> nigga. I go to the movie theater and I look and I say, "Damn, that's my man's." Yeah. Like this nigga, bro. I was so mad. I could. I wanted to rewind. <laughs> The part that I see, yeah, the theater. you know what I'm saying? Because yeah. I'm like, no, nah, this bro, like, this had, yeah. to, you know, this had to be bro. And then I went on your page, and I think I had seen you was either at the premiere. It was, it was something. Like, I, I seen something that, like, confirmed that you was in the movie. Yeah. Now, this in particular, because we still working through it. But I, That's what I'm saying. I will show you. Like, I, will. I don't be believing shit until it's out. Yeah. Well, I just did some right. shit this yeah. morning. Yeah. I didn't even post, like, hey, I'm shooting this. Yeah, because did. you never know. Nigga, Especially might, Hollywood might come stuff out. always change. It changed. But Quick. I know for I know for sure, like, I know this ago. I'm looking at the like, Because they sent me the they sent me the song this morning and I heard oh, the song. I, okay, I got an idea. I'm gonna So it, I'm I just up. can't I can't really go into I can't go into detail. I can't go into And you detail. reading it out loud. He, right. he like I don't get it. Okay, Let look. Me see. Hold on. Show, show George. So, look. So the fa- the Kelly kickback, they gonna be like, oh, this nigga Mojo. So okay. read this, read that part, and then go down, and then that's pretty much what I'm gonna be doing. Uh-huh. And then when we get offline, then I I'll tell you. Exactly. Oh, that's hot. I feel you. Though. That's I be hot. Doing, you I know be I doing that. And that shit, yeah. bro. That's and hot. when I do that, bro, like, bro, that's I want you to you. think. I want you to think of like. Uh, Drewski, remember when Drewski and Drake came yeah. together? Yeah. Uh huh. I want you to think of something like that, like, yeah. like, like how I think how impactful what me and him about to come together. What? Is. No, for sure. You, you for are, sure. You yeah. already 100%. solidified in your section, all the shit in Chicago. Yeah. And you got your own fan base outside of Chicago. Yeah. Lil Durk is one, damn near one of the biggest artists out in out, this generation just, right now. Yeah, yeah. So that's gonna go crazy. No, I know for, yeah. that, that's, that's gonna go, gonna go yeah, crazy. Bro, when, when, and I'm gonna tell you something. When Dirk DM me, now, I, honestly, bro, I don't even listen to rap like that, but Dirk mm-hmm. my favorite. What that's you my be listening rapper. to? Right. R&B. Oh, okay. Oh, you on yeah. some player shit. Yeah, bro, I, like, I keep shit smooth. Who your favorite R&B artist? 
My nephew put me on Lucky Day. My like, nephew, I love Lucky, Lucky Day. My, Lucky my Day nephew like three. He uh, like that nigga. So I'm like, man, right now, be good. For who real? I like right now on the R and B side. You seen like it a Jacquees really no. ass nigga. <laughs> Jacquees, <laughs> Jacquees is cool. <laughs> Jacquees is cool, but that ain't no. My he mama love Jacquees. He ain't no. Jacquees ain't like that. Yo. I like fuck with Lucky Day. Um. I listen to a lot. I, I like listen Gibeon. to a lot of old. I like giving you. I okay. listen to a lot of old. I got too. Chick, I you listen to the girls, girl. Summer Walker. Yes, I love. I, I like love the girl. Summer Man, Walker. what's that? Scissor got that song Sizzle right Sizzle now. Got me in a chokehold. And I, love I can't lose. lose. I like Ari Lennox. When, when I'm with, with you. you. Oh yeah, that's a black. That's what you. Can I smell I was just slapping that on the boat. That shit go hard. Yeah. So no, but no. So that shit. I don't even know how we got time about that. But yeah. So dirt. This is going to be big, is that's what we're gonna, saying. And, and I know for a fact it's going to be big just because, you know, I'm younger. I'm 22. I know what the people want, and they're yeah. going to want that. That's going you know to be moment. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you, so, know, yeah. you, know <laughs> you know what's bigger than numbers? What's bigger than numbers is uh, impact and influence and culture. Yes. Right. It's yeah. hella people that do big things, but it don't matter because it wasn't impactful or it wasn't, had nothing to do yeah. with the culture. With the culture. Mm -hmm. it, fuck the numbers. That's going to be culture That's right going to be there. culture, That's bro. timeless I think shit. that, yeah, And that's what it's going to be. It's, it, I think the fact that what I've done as far as in my lane that I've done it in and then what Dirk has done as far in the lane that he's done it in for us to, to be coming together to, 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 to do something of, the, of this magnitude, a lot of people going to applaud him I'm gonna tell you, when Dirk reached out to me, I didn't even know it was him. Mm -hmm. Because everybody had started getting these blue checks. So, <laughs> like, that's what I was like, is it really Dirk? <laughs> so somebody so somebody hit this me up. This little snurt. So I so I get a message that was like, perk. hey, I get a message that's like, hey, I, I need you for something. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, man, who the fuck is this? Because if y'all go on Dirk page, his page say 2.0. Oh, for real? It say two point, it just say 2.0. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, who the fuck is 2.0? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I kept going about my day. And then ain't I said, boozy shit 2.0 something too? <laughs> man, I ain't know what it was, but some told me, go go back and just see what it is. I go back, I click, I'm like, damn, 14 million followers. I said, damn, this little dirt. Yeah. Like, I hit the nigga right back. Like, right. Hey, like, you I my favorite rapper. Hello? What, you, what you need? Whatever you need, what you need? Oh, mama. And he like, uh, he was like, man, send me your number. And then, you know, the rest is kind of, you know, we've been, processing. Be we've been going through this for a couple of weeks. But we just made a like we made a major step today mm -hmm. because I heard the project. So mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Ain't, he, ain't nobody sending out their project. Exactly. Yeah, People don't experience. realize how deep the social media content creation can take you because now they not even getting actors damn near. They like, okay, they can do it. We they see them every it. day. The people love them. We and people don't them. realize social media, it's like you getting M's off this. That's your audition yeah. tape. Like, that's your audition tape. You never know who going to see it that you day. Never know. I'd have had the craziest people being my likes. Come, you like, oh, you ain't seen this shit. Yeah. It's crazy. Listen, the real actors going to be like, y'all got the game. Y'all got the game. Right. Fucked up. Yeah, oh, that's what no, they're going to No, for sure. But that's why I have been learning more about the social media because I'm like, you it, help, get there it helps you to transition into that industry, but uh, you're not in that industry until you're in that industry for sure. Because I even like it's like that with stand up comedy. That's why I was like, even saying that shit, like, you feel me? Like, I been fuck with your videos. Yeah. I'm like, I fuck with But you know, I don't be running across people that I think it's funny. Right. All, a lot of most people that be going viral, like, shit, not shit not funny. funny. It's right. crazy. Yeah. corny. Yeah. yeah. I'm no, like, niggas, this nigga actually going viral and it's like relatable. Niggas, <laughs> niggas say that, bro. Niggas. Nigga, what you said, niggas be like, man, I like him. It was one nigga told K to my show. He said, bro, me and my girl love you. He was like, and all I said all the way here, like, man, please let this nigga be funny because I don't want to have to stop liking this nigga, bro. Yeah. yeah. And so it be like, and, that, and that's the thing. Like, I be cool. Like, I be like, because I already know, I, when I started doing skits, I was doing stand-up. You know, I was doing both of them simultaneously, and I stopped doing skits for like six months and just put all my focus in the stand up because I was like, it don't make no sense to blow up. Mm -hmm. And then once they put you out in front of the people, you're not ready. Exactly. So I was like, let me just make sure I'm happens. ready. Yeah, and mm -hmm. I made people sure go I'm viral ready. And that's their last time. Exactly. That was it. Yeah. They couldn't. And there's could... some people that only know how to perform in front of their fan base. Right. Because when it's hella people that love you, that you can go up yeah. there and just be like, right. yeah. And they, you got, and they you got got it's really a big ass at. meet and greet. That's yeah. all it is. Feel me? He performed in front. It was like, it was people that knew him there. And it was some people that didn't know him. That didn't know him. And everybody still laughed. That ain't know You feel me? No, they had a good time, man. I was really surprised at the response that I did get of the people that did know me last mm -hmm. night when I went up. And I went, I mean, the girl, that, that, she had that motherfucker, wow, we recording tonight. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. I, you know, I was, I'm like, man, we all the way out in LA. Cause sometimes 
you know, when you doing this social media stuff and you growing, you see, you see eight hundred thousand five. You see, you don't really, you not really understanding how big you getting you and how far you going. You don't understand until you step outside. You like, damn, damn this yeah. kind of yeah. Like, yeah, because yeah. you online and you never know. Like, if you do have a meet and greet, for example, if anybody's gonna show up, yeah. you don't yeah. know because you, you know, know that this it technically. If you talk about social media, it's fake in terms of you don't know. You don't know. It's not yeah. real life. You seeing eight hundred thousand people right. or nine hundred thousand people. That's just a number. It's, it's a a number. number. Yeah. And you like shit. When it's time for them to show up, is they gonna show up? So you know, I've been touring the country. You know, the last maybe three three years. Well, ever since we came back from the pandemic, and I was touring before that. Mm -hmm. But I've seen a, a massive increase in. You know how many shows I'm doing. You know how many tickets I'm uh, I'm selling. Like I sold over seventy five hundred tickets last year. What? Oh, mama, yeah. That's just, hot. Just Congratulations to yeah. that. Right. Too, like, that's hot. Yeah, yeah. stand yeah. me. Cause so that's what you want. You want it to fold over to that account. That's yeah, what I'm saying. and that's what it's about. Yeah. And I think a lot of people just want how it look. Fuck how it look, bro. I know some of the top influence in the game that have been broke. That have yeah. went broke. Mm -hmm. Motherfuckers that we all know that have went broke. They ain't have it. Like they, it looked like they had it. But they didn't have it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Country Wayne talk about how he was down to his last 12 grand. Yeah, and I fuck with how he uh, how he bounced back. It. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So the so the bounce back, you down you you down 12 grand, and the bounce back to make yourself a multi millionaire mm -hmm. using yeah. these same platforms. I think it just it's just a testament of your hustle. Your hustle. Yeah. Everybody yeah. in real famous. life matter though. And really, it that's the, that's, it I think this our generation is fall like you know we all I do it all the time. You forgetting like sometimes it's like you know like oh, I ain't finna go to this state because I'm gonna I'm gonna go and I get yanking. Nigga, you don't know how yanking you is. Right. You gotta go. You gotta go. Right. You feel me? And right. then if you ain't yanking, you go or you done met people. People, you I yeah. think before the social media shit, people only knew each other from real from life. That community. It'll be people that been you like, know, we love you in St. Louis. Up. I'm like, St. Louis. Yeah. I don't know St. Nobody's St. Louis. They're like, we love you, girl. Stop disrespecting us. Yeah. I'm like, I know that's St. Right. Louis lit too. Oh, mama. St. Louis lit. They fuck around, around too. Four hours, what? Okay. Four hours from Chicago, St. Louis. Oh, see, he know. Yeah. St. Louis. Chicago niggas is everywhere. I ain't gonna lie. It's a lot of them out. Here. Yeah, oh, yeah for it's sure. hella Chicago Lot niggas out here. everywhere because yeah. Atlanta, <laughs> LA. Yeah, y'all. I think Chicago because you know what they told us in Chicago. In Chicago, they told us that the only way that we could be successful is that we have to leave yeah. Chicago. Yeah. We don't, you know, we don't have any, you know, people that just stayed right there in Chicago and and, and just blew up. Like we and we got a lot of niggas, man. D Ray, you know D Ray from 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 the city, man. For sure, legend. And, yeah, D Ray, legend from Chicago. For and, sure. Um, a lot of people look at him, Lil Real, you know, the, Corey the, Holcomb. Corey Holcomb. We got, you know, the, I ain't gonna producer. lie. The, my favorite comedians is from like, y'all got for sure. I think y'all got the best comedy. History, yeah, because y'all got Bernie, Bernie Mac. Mac. Bernie Mac is uh, from Chicago. All the funny people from Chicago, from Chicago. Corey Holcomb, D. Ray. It's hella people from Chicago. Chicago. That's funny. Yeah. Uh, um, where bro from? Uh, I think he's from Chicago too. Damn, all I forgot his name, bro. He hella funny though. Short guy. Um, OG Kenny, Kenny, uh, Kenny Howe. Kenny Howe. from Chicago. He hella funny. I yeah. fucked with him for yeah, sure. Yeah, Kenny Howe, funny in the motherfucker, yeah. bro. It's a lot of niggas, bro, that have come from Chicago, and I think we just been. Train like they didn't told us like mommy people didn't told me like all right bro like it's time you didn't you didn't, you didn't did everything you need to do here you need to go somewhere else and I don't really necessarily I don't necessarily feel like I have to leave I I'm planning to just because um man your hometown you have to that that's home base right so mm -hmm. anytime you go there you want to be able to sell out you can't be accessible. They shouldn't be able to see you at Walmart. Mm -hmm. They shouldn't be, you know. They should. It shouldn't. It shouldn't be like that. Um, so you have to make yourself exclusive, mm -hmm. and I think a part of that is leaving. You know, yeah. a part of that is going somewhere else. And and uh, a lot of comics then did it. Uh, I think D Ray, D Ray got the fuck up out of there. Yeah, for sure. yeah. yeah. That, uh, everybody, you know, you gotta, you gotta just move around. Yeah, yeah. You, you don't gotta, to you don't gotta, gotta leave, but you don't yeah. gotta leave, but you, you gotta be gone. You gotta yeah. work the room. Yeah, <laughs> you don't gotta yeah. leave, but you gotta, but you gotta, you gotta be gone. Yeah, yeah. yeah mama. So what is it that you do? I'm an actress first, okay. and then social media entertainment. Okay, that's what I always say. Mm -hmm. TikTok is my biggest thing, but I'm big on YouTube and the Instagram. That's my least favorite ad, but you know I look cute on there. So Damn. what? So what? What you? How many? What your subscribers looking like on YouTube? On YouTube, I have a hundred something thousand. So like you got your plaque. Yeah, but I didn't. I didn't sign up for because I really didn't care about it. I like, want that money. I wasn't. I wasn't I want trying mine. to be a YouTuber. I'm at like thirty thousand on on YouTube. Yeah, but was, it's just because you got your plaque. YouTube oh, is too, YouTube to me. 
YouTube take a lot of time. It, people don't realize yeah, that it takes a do. lot of time, and you need to get more than uh, eight minutes to even get monetized. Yeah. You don't want to get yellow marked. That's your money. Like TikTok, you could at least appeal it. Appeal it yeah. But people don't realize Y'all even on TikTok, the crazy You can button, appeal on YouTube. Yeah, you, you can, on, but YouTube, they so strict. YouTube, once you post, like, my, I ain't gonna lie, my YouTube, once I posted, like, consistent, clean, clean mm. shit, like, that was good, they'll, they'll make me, like, go through the process of my own shit. Like, did it have profanity? What level of oh, profanity in right. it? Then you be like, light, you know, light profanity, and mm. then they'll, y'all they'll approve it just based off what I put in. Y'all not scared That's of TikTok getting banned? Cause I'm not yanking gonna, on that motherfucker, so not, I'm on some hate shit. I'm like, they trying to get money weekend. out of it. You know America, but I don't, no, think, I think, I don't they, think they're going to ban it. I think it's a chance that they might ban it. Now, here's the thing. I thank God. that I got a million followers on Facebook and then half a million on, on Instagram. Uh, so because of that, I'm still going to be able to survive. Exactly. Right. You know yeah. what I'm saying? TikTok is crazy. It's my second largest platform though mm -hmm. so i would feel a type of way if they do it a motherfucker work hard to you know <laughs> yeah. to, to, to put that together all right so y'all don't ban it i don't want to fuck up my, <laughs> my people that i got but at the end of the situation. day if you really fly though inside you gonna be able to it's, you gonna fly oh, wherever yeah because they, they it's gonna you. go from one spot gonna, to where they, they, they gonna follow you where they at now that's, that's 800,000 that people that's gonna be looking for you oh, so it's either they gonna leave from over there and come to instagram and come follow you or whatever fucking platform they come out with next they gonna 800,000 people that love that for 800,000 people to follow you and 900,000 they love they like you to you. a point well yeah. I'm gonna find this motherfucker wherever he at I'm gonna oh, find him but that was the at, whole point him. is for you to get people to buy into your likeness and to actually support you so if you do come out with merch they or if you it. do come out with tickets whatever yeah, they yeah. buy it they yeah. buy so that's the whole point you not it's really not supposed to be so you can oh cause I got 800,000 cause, 800, I, got it. cause yeah. I got 900,000 I need social that motherfucker to work social media is good for, uh, for business I think, it's, yeah. I think it's bad for relationships though it's oh, he's trying to get into it. What's happening? It's horrible for relationships. Y'all know where I'm going with yeah. this. It's horrible for yeah. relationships. Because I just made... Uh, I feel like if the nigga like me, he got to unfollow all the bitches. Oh! All his bitches. Uh, no, every, he got to unfollow everybody. His mama could stay. His pastor could stay. Everybody else You said go. you was how old? I'm 22. That's part of the problem. It is, but it is what it is. Uh -huh. and now, if he problem. don't want me to be following yeah. niggas, then okay, we'll work on it. But see, but you got to figure out what sense. type of niggas. See, niggas, see, <laughs> let me tell you something. Real niggas don't even give a fuck about you following them. Yeah, yeah. Right, that's follow, what I'm yeah. saying. I don't follow Michael B. Jordan. Yeah. Follow right. Out there, bitch. Just understand, when I tell you to get up over here, Come over Come here, don't be that. Yeah, but y'all yeah. be tempted. See, if y'all following these new bitches and then they swipe up and be like, you look cute today, daddy, you gonna be like, no, I just to told you. No. I, that's how, I ain't you gonna lie. It, Girls might, not knock niggas. All you gotta do is say daddy. And you What's might, up, daddy? Like, and you might be like, I'm, I'm not even gonna link daddy. with her, but it's still the talking. The daddy shit make you fold. The daddy shit make you fold. It make you, you know fold. The daddy shit make you fold. But honestly, though, my thing is this. This is why I don't, I don't play around like that. Every chick that slide in my DM, I always be skeptical about it anyways. Because mm -hmm. one, bro, bitches be trying to set niggas up. Right. You know what I'm saying, bro? And if they think you got something, G, you don't know what nigga that is. That sent this bitch to you, you know what I'm saying? That's one. That's why I be then faking two, on that spending the night. Yeah. Then, no, you don't spend a night. I don't know where your baby out. daddy right. is. Bitch. Why does he keep talking about you yeah. spending night? The bitch, I was going on. House. He keeps oh, talking about okay, when I go, okay. when I spend the night. Come to your house or you yeah. go to the hotel. But, oh, yeah, but you don't want her in your space. Well, get a little room, man. Shit. Get a room, guys. Okay. Right? That's what I do. Take it to the hotel. I love everybody. Y'all, y'all trust? Uh, would you date a female that that's paying for a blue check for no reason? Would you like? Take her serious. That's show, it's showing a lot about who you are. If you want a blue check, if for you no want, if you, yeah, no reason. I wouldn't. For it no would reason, yeah, so she, no she reason. not. Posting She's not a public figure. She yeah, just got a blue check. Off. Yeah, it would turn me off. It would turn me off. Like yeah. for fucking what? Yeah. And, and where are you trying to? What's the end goal <laughs> here? Bitch, I'm the one. Where are you? I'm the one. <laughs> oh, see so you. You wanted them in your, in your relationship. Like the girl, Kate. Would you rather your girl have her own motion, or do you feel like that would kind of make you feel like? No. Less of a man. No, because I'm him, so it don't okay, matter good. if she got motion okay. or not. Like, yeah. if she got motion, that 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 makes it even better. Because yeah. now the shit that we could do together, yeah, the shit we could do, the shit that we could do together would be crazy. So it it wouldn't even be that. I'm me and my entity, and then you, you are who you are, and then when we come we together, to collaborate. Yeah, yeah. Whatever right. that is. I'm not That's a fan it. of yours. Like you're yeah. just 100 yeah. percent you, and you yeah. lit. Nah, no, bitch. and it ain't like I got you got shaking too. Yeah, and it Run. ain't like you gotta just you gotta just be consumed into what the fuck I got going on. I want you right. to have your own motion. I yeah. want you. And to have I do. Your own shit. I love my ladies. So this was the un the controversial opinion I have. I do feel like if you ask a nigga for something, you should be able to buy it yourself. So if you I ask a nigga for Prada shoes. Yeah. Let me know that you if if you don't see your girl spin and you know she could come with her own product shoes, that's hot. I hate the all break a nigga 
thing or even breaking the bitch out. I hate the pimp mentality. I hate the girl trying to get it out of the nigga because mm-hmm. I do feel bad for y'all. It is a lot of weight on y'all to take care of everything. And then, bitch, on top of that, you want some shoes? Yeah. Like, it, it is, it's How stressful. you feel about paying a female bills? Because my thing is like, I'm not in another. You can that. pay a bill or two. I'm not. I'm a, she can pay her own bills. I got my own bill bills. You got your own bills. I'm now we gonna do all that when we. But she should move be making together. it easier. If we for live you together, too. listen. He's paying right, all the. If we live together, he's paying all If we live together, my girl like ain't gonna have to pay shit. I agree. Only because this, I'm gonna have to pay these bills, bitch. Whether you here or right, not, nah. these bills got to get paid regardless. Mm-hmm. All right, you being here is just you know it, it's. It's, it's other things that you I could, feel like you're going to be able yes. to pick up and help me with, mm-hmm. you know, as far as you being my woman. Mm-hmm. Um, now, she living on her own, mm-hmm. right? And she called and she, babe, light bill, this motherfucker, $400, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I'm sure that I got to pay this, I got to pay that. You my girl, I'm going to take care of that. That's mm-hmm. hot. You know what I'm saying? If it's, if it's, if, if, if it's, you know, your rent, you short a couple hundred dollars on the rent, mm-hmm. I got you. If it's mm-hmm. your birthday, I might just pay the rent for you mm-hmm. just so you can keep a little money in your pocket that month mm-hmm. if I fuck with you. Mm-hmm. Now. You see how the, the whole demeanor changed on now, the now, said, now, now. Let's get back to these hoes. Right. What I ain't going to do now. I know, and it's like, how you want it out this nigga? He don't know you from the can of pain. Man, it's listen just like, to me. You trying I to run the game on the nigga. It's just chick. corny. I was talking corny. to a chick that I had just met. No bullshit. Talk to a chick that I just met, and she had asked me for like eight hundred dollars. I'm talking about we was talking for about a week. Mm-hmm. She said she need to get her brakes fixed. I'd have been like, "Bitch, where your daddy at?" Wait, did y'all hang out I already? Did ask her that. You on my mama. So she just said, "Look, my bra- have y'all been talking, conversing?" For about a week. We was on and how was that going? Where she felt comfortable enough to do that? I don't know because I never let a bitch feel like that they can right. ask me for money. And, and you was like, "Hell no, nah. mm-hmm. I got it." For you. I, I I ain't say that. I was just I was trying to figure out, you know, you know how motherfuckers telling you that they fucked up, mm-hmm. and you don't know if they telling you because because they finna ask you for something or right. they just need to listen and ear. So I was listening. I'm like, damn, that that's that's crazy. crazy. Like, yeah, I said you say the brakes rub it like they make a noise. <laughs> You gonna fuck the rotors up, bitch. You, you gonna need six feet. He trying to get tips. You trying to get yeah. tips and shit like that. Oh, oh, that's so, so it was funny. like, you know, it was yeah. like a dead silence on the phone after a while. And I'm like, shit. Well, But that's why my pride be so fucked up. I wish I could ask for something. I wish. Because, I wish but it was like, more women in the world like you. I want, like I want, you, I want to ask so bad. That's the Bay Area shit. No, but Man, because, I wish it was more women like that. A nigga ain't never gonna say he could take something from me. He did something for me. Like, it's good, little Now, I don't do that, though. Like, if I give you something, if I give you something, it's yours. You know what I'm saying? It's yours. I, that shit don't even come up. Like, I don't want it back. These new niggas throw it in your face. Yeah, and I learned my yeah. lesson. I'm going to tell, like, tell you what happened. Bitch, just mashed those. Calm down, nigga. I was a young nigga. I probably was like 22 at the time. I was fucking with this chick. I can't believe I'm telling this story. <laughs> I was fucking with this chick, and um, I had just got... I had just I had just came up on some money. I think it was financial aid. I had came mm-hmm. up on some, so I bought a whole bunch of lingerie from Walmart. I know that's and, right. Like I mean, we I mean we we running it up. So mm-hmm. then she like, I want to go to the sex toy store and spice it up. I said, let's do it. We go to the sex toy store, and at this time I was promoting parties. So I used to be, you know, we used to go to different colleges throwing parties. Mm-hmm. So she like, I want you to buy me a, a dildo, you know what I'm saying, for when you out of town. Damn, you bought somebody a dildo? That's so I hot. bought it. That's it's I ain't big. buying no, I got no, dick. I'm no. not buying you no dildo. But it's not about that, so she can play with it on FaceTime. Bitch, that got me finish. fucked up talking about a dildo. Let me, oh let, me, my. let me finish, guys. <laughs> let me finish. Dude. Let me tell you why I, don't, why I ain't no Indian giver no more. Uh, so. <laughs> you like, give me that dildo so back, bitch. <laughs> so we get into an argument. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, I'm like, man, I want all that shit back I bought. And I was texting this shit. I was like, I want all that shit back. Put all that lingerie in the bag. Put that, uh, I'm like, put that dick in the bag, too. I'm coming to pick it up. And, and the bitch texted me back and was like, yeah, you would want the dick back. And I was like, whoa, hold on, hold on. And it fucked me up. It fucked me up. <laughs> Cause why would you ask for why that back? Why ask for that back? <laughs> he asked I was so mad. I asked He's for like, that, dick. that dick back too, Gee. bitch. Put it in oh, the bag. Oh shit, Gee. bro! You know you been out for that. So after that, I was like, you know, I ain't asking for shit else back, dude. Right. Yeah, yeah that's that. janky. I was fucked up. You was down bad. I was bogus for that. And y'all Damn. cut this part out. He's gonna he gonna clip this That's and put clip, it on right TikTok. There. <laughs> That's the clip. I ain't even gonna you, comment you. on this shit. I ain't even. I'm gonna act like I ain't right, see it. Right. He gonna hit me like you know I just posted. I mean fuck you. I told y'all cut that out. Okay. 
No, nah, but now nah, uh, I can tell you a toxic nigga by your skits, though. Yeah, I'm toxic, bro. Yeah, but people you, assume you, that I don't think I'm that toxic. And I people think, think, you think are. people think I'm toxic. I'm really not. I'm you really sound like it. Anytime a woman can sit up here and say a nigga got to unfollow all the women that he all yeah, of that's them. Toxic. No, for real. Yeah, that's because you like keep Beyonce. You know what I'm saying? Like you can keep B because she got a husband, but don't just be following bitches out here because niggas be tempted. We'll be arguing like a motherfucker. Yeah, it'll that's be, out. It'll be day twelve. Yeah, that's uh, all these bitches are still here. What I'm unfollowing them for? They ain't did nothing to me. But, see, yeah, but they want to, nigga. And that's the problem. <laughs> Shit. Fuck see, that. Instagram, I'm social them media, and fucked up days. And now, I wish it, it, up. it you did. You can't have friends no more. You Everybody on podcast talking about relationships no and right. alpha men and alpha oh, women I hate and shit. It. Like, this shit oversaturated. Look, I gotta, gotta put you through the test, though, gang. I gotta put you through the test. All right, put me on. All right. Let's see your explore page. Mm. That's very telling. Oh, for I real. I just seen a nigga see your I, page, It's guys. gonna be women on my shit. Let me see. Let's see how bad it is, though. Let me see. That's gonna if be your a shit, right there. If your mm. shit look see. like how I know it look. How yours look? Let me see. If, if his shit look bad, I don't, I don't even know how to. Okay, here it go. <laughs> oh, yeah, straight cheeks on mine. Oh, <laughs> turn, turn the camera. Here. Let's see, gang. Can y'all see this? <laughs> Yeah, like this Let shit. Let me see. You, can't, you, have, you this? can't have a nigga in this climate. <laughs> you can't have a nigga in this climate Damn, because of so on. many options. Hold on, show this one. This the one that stands out. It's Woo! Like, that thing heavy, too. I just want to die. And then it's like, you know your nigga looking. It's just, I want to die. That thing heavy, too. It's fuck heavy. All right, let me show y'all. Let me see yours. Let me show y'all. Ooh, they acting a fool on my Explorer page. Oh! Ooh, look at this. So at this point, just What's uninstall up? the app fucking with me. Uninstall oh, the app. going out. Mine's ain't that bad. Let's see. It looks like really? you're tweaking shit around. I Let's ain't doing that. nothing. Oh, he got some kids on there. Oh, okay. Yeah. I've been, been redoing my shit. I've been oh, like that. Oh, you hosting? No, he got see? ass on this shit, though. This girl <laughs> yeah. got her nipples out. Wait, yeah. Look at me. See, he, he tricked me. He got a chicken sandwich on his sport page. This nigga me. just wants some pussy and get some food. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Well. He got a Popeye chicken sandwich and hella ass. That ain't got nothing to do with me. I only I don't know oh, why yeah. it's, it's a, a couple holes I know on this motherfucker. No, nah. damn. I don't know. He even got a. I don't, I don't know. know. And don't he got know. all different flavors. This bitch is with dreads. Ah. It's been <laughs> with lace. That's crazy. Let me see your explore page. Yeah. There's probably some holes on there too. I know that's oh, right. My mama. Let this is a bitch. I always pop up. You ever seen her? Let me see. Hey, I ain't gonna she lie. always Let pop up on there. You seen her before? She always pop up. I ain't seen her. She got big ass head. Yeah. See, mine not bad. It's women dressed up, fashion, see, fashionable like, looking. It's the, the it's a girl that keep popping up on my explore pad. I don't know her. But uh, the little Nia Long girl in right. Atlanta. Nia Long. I ain't never seen her. Yeah, it's like it's like a girl that look like Nia Long and her well, shit. Let me see what she got ain't nothing but you be looking at number of bitches. Let me too. see this your explore page. Oh she God. don't look at no niggas. Woo! You got me. <laughs> It ain't no niggas on here. Women's basketball, <laughs> she looking at that. them. <laughs> Bro, it ain't, no, it ain't no niggas on there. That is a good little little tester it real is. fast. Like, what you say? No, okay, see what you do. Kyle, let's see yours. Ooh. Yeah, what you got? What you got? <laughs> it's a bunch of houses on there. Oh, that, oh no, I've been looking at the houses. Though. Gold digging ass. <laughs> Hell of mansions on our explore page. I'll be on Zillow picking it out, <laughs> manifesting something. I'm in real estate. It's crazy. Let me see. That's her fake account. Uh, she cool. That's, what she I, cool. that's the private. Yeah, she good. That's the private good account, y'all. Let me see. I'm she, good money. Bitch. she good money for sure. Look at him. Oh, yeah. He squinted a little. I ain't gonna yeah. lie. I never. I never thought of that. She like niggas with muscles though, for sure. Oh, ah! you I like buff seen, niggas? I seen a couple yeah, I niggas. Some right. I, I know. Niggas. I don't want no scrawny ass nigga. Damn. I seen a couple muscles oh, like, here. Damn. No, I'm cool. I'm cool. <laughs> no, you be in the cool. gym, bro. Yeah, you, you be in the gym. Sense, Not consistently, but oh, I go okay. enough where I, I can get a nigga off me. If I gotta get a nigga up off yeah. me, I'm gonna get I'm not stuck nowhere. Uh -huh. I know how to move niggas. Uh -huh. <laughs> but that's the problem. It's too many options since we're talking about it. I think that is the case. It's I too think, many I damn think... options. It's like, is, is there any love anymore? Like, even back in the day, yes, it might have been some old niggas cheating. He had a family down the street. Mm -hmm. But it's like, one, she wouldn't know. The wife would not know. And on top of that, it wasn't so many bitches. Half of them hoes was not cute. You know what I'm saying? They wasn't seeing the hoes in New York. They wasn't seeing the hoes in Chicago. Was they wasn't Carlos seeing the hoes in Florida. Yeah, now we can see the hoes everywhere. Everywhere. Yeah. everywhere. I'm even looking at the hoes. See that? It is so hoes. You can't be here. trusted either. I know, mm. but I'm working on it. That's crazy. You turn around now, she's scissoring somewhere. <laughs> 
<laughs> she ain't answering the fucking phone because she doing the scissors. I'm scissors. working. Yeah, on. everybody want to get flew out the country now. It's like me, y'all bitches didn't have it standard no, uh, in 2010. Can't even spell combo. Now y'all, they y'all, y'all ain't been on a vacation. A vacation? Yeah. yeah oh, okay. I've been to on where? One. I don't no, I've been all over the place tip. like space, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm all here. Yeah, yeah, where you yeah, been? Yeah. Uh, I've been, I've been a few places myself. Yeah, you been I'm on vacations. Travel. I've been vacations, a few vacations, family vacations. Vacations, family. you got flew out. It's no, a difference. No, vacations, vacations. Have you ever been flewed out? No. You lying? Out of out of country? No, I'm just saying in general. My friend had her birthday party in Cabo. Her nigga flew me out. No, that ain't what we talking about. It was multiple women, though. That ain't what we talking about. Yeah, that's about. how you get flew out. We you gonna have to go have with a nigga, pack. Have a nigga oh, clone no, you out. No, no, no. Okay. Because I be a little too scary. I'm paranoid. I be watching ID channel and shit. I'm like, uh-uh. He might try to kill me, split me in two. I'm good. What about if you fly? What What would you do if a female, you flew a female out, right? And mm. then she get on her period wherever you at? That happened to me before. That's fucked up. How do that go? Stay. What you mean how it go? How do it go? We go get in the fucking shower. Oh, that's hot. Wait, you not laying a towel down? If we ain't gonna shower, I let it down down, but what the fuck? We ain't gonna waste what we waste we ain't wasting what we wasting it for. That's janky. Right. Man. So you don't God. have period sex? You true. Grow I like up, that. Bro, let me tell you something. Real, bro. Up. Let me tell you something, Lou. Let me tell you something. Uh, that 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 period pussy is uh, hot. That's a different type of that's pussy. That's a different type of That's a different type. They, they, Y'all light skin motherfuckers is nasty. I like you. That's that light skin shit. shit. That That's like that light skin shit. That nigga, that period. Chicago. <laughs> that period pussy something Told else, you the Chicago niggas freaky. Okay, I'm not a light. Nigga, that period pussy different, bro. I, I mess with Chicago dude one time. That period pussy is different. Y'all it's scam different, all bro. day. I mean, What you like about it? What I like about yeah. it? Yeah. Nigga, one, it be wet. That shit be wet, gang. Red wet. wet. It be wet. I mean, close your eyes. You got to close your eyes? You keep your eyes yeah. open. When you get in the shower, stop, gang. <laughs> Look at you. Mm. <laughs> he trying they to get you the, the strategy. Stop, they got the hot water. What about the first day, though, when that when The that shower. He, the first day you go in the shower, gang. I still lay the towel you down. Lay the, the you lay the towel down, maybe like, you, you lay the towel down, period, if y'all not in the shower. But, but you know, that, that third, fourth day, that's when it's at its best. That's when it's tender, cause it's coming. It's coming. They you know, coming that down. That pussy starts smelling like pennies when it get the bleeding. No, she don't uh-huh. take care of herself when she on a period if it smell oh, like mama, that. Motherfuckers get to smell like yeah. pennies. You know, it's penny I, smell like I, I, copper. Yeah. Smell a smell of penny. Like copper. Like copper. Yeah. Oh yeah. No. Yeah. 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 That's good. yeah. Yeah, you know, we like, Lou, we like. Lou, I got to get you out, man. I gotta yeah, get you. Bro, you I'm acting so amateur. You embarrassing us today. I'm really I'm surprised, though. Right. Because, yeah. because when I seen you fuck with D-Ray, I was like, yeah. That's a nasty nigga. nigga. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. I fuck with the freaks. Yeah. I'm not the freak. <laughs> My women freaky. <laughs> I'm the nigga. Do all the freaky shit on that. me. You just yeah. said that. <laughs> he said do all the freaky shit on me. <laughs> I like freaks. I just ain't the freak. Do the freaky right. shit on me. Yeah. Right. Uh-huh. Oh, mama. Well. Wait, what's your sign, though? I'm one of them. Oh, uh, here you go with this am. shit. Wait. What's yours? I'm a Scorpio. Okay. November 7th. When your oh, birthday? Okay. Yeah. I'm a Aquarius. Oh, my daddy in Aquarius. February, January. February. Okay. So what Wait, the fuck? my daddy, February What 14? that's going to mean February after you night. find this oh. up? Oh, you know, I'm going to keep it in my mind because, you know, people love to say you discriminate. So I'm just going to note it. Aquarius, now nah, we we good motherfuckers, though. No, I don't fuck with y'all. I mean, yeah. y'all. We I really don't wait, 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 No, I'm not no, going to no, say tell me about us. Okay, so. Because I can boom. tell you about y'all Scorpios real quick. Well, you don't know nothing about us. My baby mama's Scorpio. November, October. November. What? Uh, 18th. Damn. Right. And she fucked up. No, she not. So you think Scorpios is fucked up? Yes. No, we are not fucked bro, up. We are all, intense. Bro, first we're of passionate. All, bro, they're passionate. They think everything is about them. That's women in they general. They think they, no, 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 it's different. They think they always got to speak the fuck up and say something. They don't know when to shut the fuck up. Mm, she do talk a lot. Yeah. yeah, but so no, Niggas, sometimes I listen back. I'm learning how to just. You need to write. You need the type of man that's gonna tell. You, like he, he don't even gotta tell you to shut the fuck up. You just know by the by yeah, the way. No, he when a nigga himself. is so calm, you like I got to sit my because <laughs> I can't lose it. He's a good man, Savannah. Yep. But um, no, Aquarius is, I feel like you guys always do stuff the opposite of what everybody else does. You guys go against the grain. That's hot. Um, you guys are into like really eclectic stuff. Like I don't. Do you do a lot of research? I, I Google some shit. Fast. That's what I'm saying. That's yeah. how my daddy is. I feel like in relationships, though, y'all not y'all are cheaters. Y'all nah. are y'all are cheaters. Are but, you a cheater? <laughs> I look over this nigga staring right. <laughs> <at me. laughs> yeah. Put this, this nigga in the corner. The thing, Since the he put me in the love, corner about this freaky <laughs> shit. But you you like, don't eat ass. You don't fuck bloody pussy. <laughs> he like cheater. You don't. 
But y'all not gonna do you everything know. for everybody, but the people that y'all care for, you know, y'all, the the, y'all gonna a freak. manage y'all relationship. But yeah. They had to put me in the corner because I ain't a freak. And that's the truth, and you know that's the truth. No, 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 I don't. You have cheated. No, I've never cheated. I don't believe you. You look like he, you be cheating. Look he, at this nigga. He's twiddling his toes. He's crossing nah, them. Nah, I mean, Stop lying. If y'all give me a chance to talk, <laughs> y'all worse than the motherfuckers on first floor. <laughs> <laughs> Put the hamburger out for the nigga. Let's see what he tell us here. This is what I will say. When I have been in committed relationships, mm-hmm. keyword, committed yes. relationships, I have been 100% faithful to my partner. Now, if we... Just was talking. Well, duh, talking is yeah, I'm that's cheating different. during. The, well, it's, not, yeah. it's technically yeah. not cheating. Yeah. It's talking, dating, dating exclusively, and then we in a relationship. Yeah, all that shit before we in a relationship, I be doing other shit. That's cool. Oh, mama's. But, but, well, what but if y'all dating a, exclusively though? Huh? What if y'all dating exclusively though? We're in a relationship if we dating exclusively. Yeah. That's how you feel? Yeah, yeah. you gotta okay. you that's you in a relationship, y'all just keeping it yeah, private. We just keeping it private. Oh, yeah. okay. And so that's how, how I, I would prefer my relationship to How be. long before Me y'all too. are y'all ever private, gonna go public if you in a relationship? Would the y'all only, ever go public the in a time only like way, this? The I ain't gonna lie, I'm thinking about it now though, cause oh. niggas going up off that shit. I'm gonna knock one of these little famous saying. bitches. Niggas is nigga. doing I'm the, be the first comedian. Yeah. On some listen, like, I'm telling you, it makes people like you more for some when they see a couple, it's like they buying into this shit, like could be me. Nah, I don't know my what thing is. is this. I I would, but I would publicly do it, but it would have to be the right situation. Mm-hmm. So it, I would if I was gonna be publicly doing it. It would have to be somebody that would be just as affected by it as me. Yeah. Being public. Yeah, so, right. So, for example, like, both of y'all got followers. Mm-hmm. Like, I would, if it was like that. That's what I'm saying. It would have to be like that. But yeah. I'm not going public. Yeah, I'm not turning you up. Followers. Yeah, I'm not turning you no, up. Oh, my mama. Men always are so scared yeah, about yeah, yeah, I'm not doing men that. Are always That's so how you already got to be lit. Then we posting each other. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Because I'm not gaining shit. Yeah. I'm not gaining nothing from this. But you're not supposed to be gaining. Who cares about the followers? No, 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 everything got to make sense, love. Everything got to make sense. You a transactional nigga. Everything got to make sense. He is, he's a tra- You need to be clear about that, though. Yeah, I am not- clear. <laughs> I just made it clear. The shit got to make sense. If it don't make sense, I'm not doing it. Because okay. here's the thing. My mom and daddy been together 38 years. That's oh, hot. that's dope. My daddy ain't never posted my mom on Facebook. Damn. What? My, my dad, too, though. They've been together for 30 some years, and my dad ain't never posted. My dad don't but got do a Facebook. My daddy don't got a Facebook. Real neither. OG, so nigga. So you know my mama. Then, if they I knew he had that some this shit is coming. Point, this is the point that I'm trying to make. I'm listening. That. A relationship can thrive without that. Yeah. Right? No, of course. We don't Duh, need that. Wait, social media so, just came about, let's say, however many years ago. So if I was to do that, because it's not been something that's been required before this time, mm-hmm. if I was to do that, I'm going to do it in a way that it makes sense. Yes, I agree. It's going to make us some money. We gonna like yeah. this. If it ain't making that, Damn. and all we doing yeah. is putting motherfuckers in our business, hmm. I ain't doing it. Facts. But what about when the business get tied up? Say, say it gets sticky. Y'all we, break be, up? we both got something to lose. We though. got something to lose now. Right. I'm not the only one losing. So you feel like, okay, well then, isn't that how people feel about marriage? Like, you need to be married to somebody because it make it easier to divorce, for example. Or you have the business tied It make up. it harder to it divorce. Harder that's to divorce. Yeah, yeah, that's what I meant to say. Yep. My bad. Yeah. Because yeah. so, yeah. you got other shit to, you got to consider. Shit to consider. Yeah. Like, oh, I'm going to have to move out of my house. We had a mortgage. We, we got all types of other shit. Yeah, so, so I get what you're saying. It got to make it even for me to get married. Mm-hmm. I feel the same way. Like, for me to get married, it has to make sense. Oh, it's sense. a show has to make it sense. Can't, I, I ain't, I'm not getting married to a motherfucker that, nah. Uh, that I know I might divorce. It gotta I want to It got to make sense. Financially, it got to make sense. Because at this point in our lives, marriage, you know, back in the day when our parents got married, bro, mm-hmm. you know, it, it wasn't necessarily a business decision. It was we was in love. We had kids. This what you know. This what we. Sometimes was the right thing it to was do. business though, because you know back in the day they would sell a motherfucker a dark, color purple, for example. Mm-hmm. Remember yeah, when well, they sold those? About, you talking about hella somebody. back talking, in the day? Uh, well, yeah, we, we talking about eighties. I thought we was taking it back. I thought we were taking it back. You talking back back way I thought we were taking it back. Yeah, you talking about motherfucking Kuta Kinte when they was getting married? Not doing the Kuta Kinte. Yeah, that ain't what we talking about. And now though, yeah. now with the way the, the way the shit is, it's like I want to be with somebody that has damn near equally the same amount of shit I to agree. lose that I do. I do agree because if I you yeah. ain't gonna fuck my life up. Hmm. I, I, I and you you leaving with you everything. I'm leaving with nothing. Dre you done trained me. <laughs> You ain't Dr. Dre me. Okay. Nah. Oh, mama, it happens, so it's gonna it be some Jay Z Beyonce niggas. breaking up around this bitch. On my mama. On oh, mama's. On my mama. Now that's some real shit. So that that aspect of it now. And I think honestly, for anybody that that 
really like busting on social media like it's hard it's hard to date it's hard it to is, be in relationships it is hard to date yeah. and then especially if they know you oh my god it's so like i just don't i don't want to be with you if you know me if you done heard of me that's I hard now though that's hard, hard now people know yeah. You. yeah so many people know you yeah, i had a chick hard. try to act like she never knew who i was then and you then, get the bitch drunk she's like i like you yeah you like, i don't what? like tell me you know me from the job just tell me you know me from the job you ain't gotta fake it yeah you already you start off the relationship plan like how you said you had to plan like i know this nigga was i'm gonna act like i don't know because i'm not gonna lie i do have homegirls and stuff that will oh i look the nigga up know who the nigga is then when you link, it's like play a clue, cool, but it's like this is why the nigga ain't respecting the bitch because you might as well just a nigga gonna respect him more if you keep it up front, just as I would, front. just as I would as well. But yeah. I don't want no fan ass bitch. Though. Yeah, you gotta keep this yeah. shit up front, bro. I don't bro. want no fan ass. And I'm saying a lot of women, a lot of women, bro, you know, they they do that, they do the fake like they don't know you shit, then they end up coming out, you know that they that they did know you and, and it's like. Bam, back to hell was you know what was the plan? And what now you didn't get too deep. You done got this bitch pregnant. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Damn, you know what I'm saying? jumped the pregnancy. Right. You got time to tell. I thought y'all just met. I'm trying to shit have happened. <laughs> bro, shit have happened, bro. Oh, I'm, trying to, bro I'm trying to tell you, bro, shit yeah. happened, bro. And I'm gonna tell you how you will know if a motherfucker really know you. It's he when got you tell all him the your techniques. name. If you tell him your name, right? Mm -hmm. If I meet a woman and I be like, my Mojo Brooks, mm -hmm. I ain't calling you no Mojo. I ain't like everybody else. When they well, talk like that, you then. when they talk like that, yeah. and they tell you they not gonna call you by what the world is addressing you by, yeah. and they trying to, you know, you trying to skip the steps of getting to know me, yeah, bitch, or you just no, want to be more process. special then, yeah, 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 it is yeah. A process. just a process. like it would be a process of people getting to know each other, yeah, it's a process, yeah, for sure. Yeah, don't be trying to find out my family name and then call me that call, shit. Oh, see, now that's yeah, the thing about Scorpio, yeah, no, I'm not gonna call no nigga by his street. I'm not calling you Bobo Head or whatever the fuck. I'm calling you Terrence. That's what your mammy named you. Well, you you know you got some things for real talk. I think you need to go talk to the lady. I try, you know what? I tried to talk to the lady. I went should. off on that bitch. I'm See, oh, <laughs> you probably did. You probably no, did. I didn't. I didn't. You but, talked um, to the lady before? Have I talked to the lady? Yeah. You know I'm going to start talking to the lady. I've got it. to a point in my life where that I'm open to going to talk to the lady. Mm. Just because, bro, in the industry that we are in, bro, it's very demanding. It's mm. so many people counting on us. There's mm -hmm. so many people pulling on us. And sometimes, bro, we genuinely don't really have anybody to fuck to talk to. Or to lean yeah. on. Because yeah, everybody true. think we good. Yeah. So to be able to go to somebody who don't know you, they don't know, they don't give a fuck about what you have, yeah. what you know, and then be able just to sit down and say, hey, this is how I feel about this. This mm -hmm. is healthy. I so agree. I'm at that point now where I, I'm ready. I actually been looking, I, but I want, I want some. I want to talk to somebody that look like me. A, a black therapist. We yes. could just come out and say, I want a black therapist. Oh, I don't care if it's male or woman, but it definitely needs to be somebody that looks yeah. like me because you know what am I gonna learn from somebody who's never walked these steps? Facts, because right. we got black issues. And we got DNA ancestry yeah, issues. Yeah, nigga, we got OG seventy issues. We still do it right now. And that's nigga, that's real chromosome shit. issues. Don't ignore that. That's real shit. Oh, mamas. Yeah. That's real shit. Hell yeah. You understand me? We over here. We didn't got deep. We started talking about <laughs> therapy and hella shit. We oh, fighting mama. demons in this yeah, bitch. We, everybody we in here. thug mansion oh, around this bitch. It. We all going through it right now. Oh, <laughs> this life but it is shit. But true. What he said was true. Especially the, with the industry, it's demanding. It's demanding, bro. Yeah. Anxiety. Really and you, it ain't no, you know, it ain't no, like, in this shit, you know, you can't at, at this time at the rapid pace that it's new people coming out. You every can't day. take no breaks. Yeah. You can't take no fucking take breaks. One it's a day new nigga on coming out every day. Oh my mama. It's a new nigga out every day, every bro. Day. So it ain't ain't no breaks. Ain't no time to step away to, to clear your mind or nothing like that. Like them motherfuckers that's following you. And, and, a, like and you, a new nigga that's taking tips from you. The new and coming with it. And remixing it. I'm remixing our shit. I'm like, hold on, bitch. This is my whole bar for bar. Bro, you know how many niggas I done seen, bro, at that ring camera, bro? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, I, I didn't even see niggas do, with his ring camera. Bro, and they I, went didn't, up to I didn't wow. see, bro. You know how many niggas I didn't see? And, bro, here's the thing. I don't care about it, bro. You know, Popeyes and KFC, they both fried chicken. Yep. Go on get in the camera all you want. You know what I'm saying? I, but I, what I respect more, like, K-Beauty over there, the, how I even found her, mm -hmm. she had did a voiceover in one of my videos mm -hmm. and shit. That's and I'm fair. talking about she did that shit verbatim. I'm talking about word for word. And I fucked with that. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Because I still, you know what I'm saying? I yeah. still was acknowledged as and Yeah, you got some the homies that shit high. Yes. Yeah. So when 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 you when you just see niggas that's doing it and then you go to the nigga page 
and the nigga not even following you or nothing. The nigga try to it's act like, like they never the seen nerve, you before. Nigga. Like, gee, I got videos of that shit with 20 million views on it, and you want me to believe you, that you don't ain't know never me? Never seen me, nigga. You don't know me. 20 million views. You don't see my shit. You know me, bro. And, and I, I don't get mad about it, bro. And it, you know, it's bro. You know how it is. It's the same thing as stand up, bro. It'd be a nigga sit there watch your whole set and leave, and go up on stage and do your joke talking about he was freestyling. Yep. What? For yep. real? What? Hell yeah. Oh, I would be mad. That what? cut with the game, free throws and fouls. And see, yep. that should inspire yep. you. You gotta keep <laughs> you, yes. you gotta keep creating more content. That's what's yep. inspiring about it, but it is once again stressful. Because yeah. you thought you had a motherfucking you ingredient you list had, and now you gotta people you taking gotta it. But that's up. what it is. Once you and that's yeah. what the internet is, once you put it out, everything is, is up, up for up grabs. grabs. Yep. So yeah. motherfuckers see it, they gon' they gonna do it. But that's why the most important thing and I tell anybody that they got a social media presence is is that not your content can't be the only thing that stands out. You, as a person, mm-hmm. you have to stand out. People have to like you. Yep. You don't got to be the funniest. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? You don't got to be the flyest. Mm-hmm. You don't got to be none of that. Yeah. If people like you, yeah. If people like you, if they like you, yeah. It don't matter what you do. They gonna they eat gonna it up. eat it up. Facts. They gonna roll. That's why Snoop a legend. And that's why he didn't last like so Snoop. Bro. It's just Snoop. Bro, look at Kevin Snoop, Hart, bro. Yep, Kevin everybody, Hart. everybody be quick to say, oh, Kevin, Kevin ain't the funniest nigga doing it. Cool. Be that's likeable. how you feel. But that I nigga's like the memes, bro. oh my God. Hell, he's he's likeable. Day. Yeah. Every and I'm gonna tell you something. And the, that, that what I just said on some real shit, I follow a lot of comedians. I done read a lot of niggas' books. Kevin Hart laid a blueprint out in his book Damn. on how to be how to how to get to he it's in his book and in his book I love what to I read, just said so I might just pick that one it. up then what he said in his book is you ain't got to be the funny I mean this is what I'm telling you verbatim what it said in the book you got to be likable and when you think about what he's saying and you look at what he's done and how far he's went he's been likable yeah. everybody's liked him it don't matter who it is everybody's like him and the niggas that don't like him want to be him want to be him yeah Yep. That's, that's that game guy. Hey, that's how we gonna wrap it up on that one. That was some uh game from Kevin Hart and Mojo bro. <laughs> <laughs> that's what this about, yeah. man. Getting game and passing it on. Yes, because you could have read it and kept it to yourself. Yeah, no, no, bro. Read that your no on some real yeah. shit though, bro. No, and I, before we get up out of here, Lou, I, I I watched you last night and I seen you, you know, times before that. And bro, you got all the tools, you know what I'm saying, Appreciate to to that. to 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 be you know one of those guys it's enough room for everybody at the top and you bro i'm gonna tell you what you got on your side bro and i think a lot of dudes is not really paying attention to this right now what's happening in the comedy game is there there's nobody young Mm -hmm. that's coming up right that can do stand up Mm -hmm. and that can maintain a social presence we don't got it ain't no young dudes you know what i'm saying if you look at all the niggas that's really young that's coming up off social media what does the stand-up look like? Exactly. That'd be my whole thing. What does the stand-up look like? Yeah. And if it's not there, then that means that the lane is wide open. Mm. Because everybody else that's blowing up off these skits and shit like that, they wouldn't. They scared of the stage. It's niggas that won't even, like, no, I, I won't do that. Like, I'm just a comedic actor. Yeah. And we see a lot of these dudes, you know, they go out on tours and shit like that, and it don't go good. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And then now <laughs> they back on the internet or they you know they got little movie roles and stuff like that but as far as in the stand up world bro we still hearing names of legends that's yeah. still going through clubs that's still doing these package shows we still seeing Mike Epps mm-hmm. you know we still seeing yeah. OG D Ray Davis we still yeah. seeing Earthquake on shit we still and there's nothing wrong with that Michael Blackson like that's cool yeah. that's the OG's they paved the way for us but who is next you know what I'm saying? We yeah. got, you know, you know, we got the 85 South Show, yeah. DC. Shout out to Carlos. the team. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. they're my niggas. Like I, yeah. I, I got hella respect for them. Yeah. But after them, then who? Us. That's what I'm saying. Ah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> from the bed in Chicago, <laughs> man. Yes, yeah, Stan like Lee. It's a new run, man. Yeah, <laughs> it was hard times, but nigga, now it's our time. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, right. man. Tweeting that one. Yeah, That's man. Right. Tweeting that one too. Oh, yeah. mamas, you feel me? Hard time. Yeah. Yeah. Spell that a certain way. This is normal <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mamas. Yeah, now it's the Cali kickback, man. I appreciate you coming through, man. No, love, bro. Before I, you know, I told you in the beginning, but I truly respect you as a as an artist, as a creator, and I am a fan, and I, I just. Appreciate that we able to 
meet and you know what I'm saying had these conversations because our peers need to come together. Our generation be seeing each other on the internet, but nigga, we gotta we gotta take it back to the old school, when man. Linking up, man. Linking up, me? collaborating, yeah. and create something bigger. Yes. Nigga, we better together. Yeah. Hello. Oh, mama. Stronger together. You feel me? So let's put it together like leather, man. You understand me? Yeah. Lucas, I appreciate you yeah, for coming yeah. through. You understand me? It's the Kelly Kickback, and we'll see y'all next time. Thank you. I love everybody. Yeah.